Hey, this is Night Flame, and I'm here to review uh, Fantastic Four issue number five. Um, extra, uh, you know, this is an extra sized issue. Basically, it's the end of the first arc, which is you know the the fall of the Fantastic Four. So you know, um, this issue, this issue was good. I felt like it was really good. It um. It was uh, it was basically the whole issue was just a trial. It, the the Fantastic Four are being put on trial. They're being blamed for things that they didn't you know necessarily cause. But at that moment, like if we read it right now in a um, series and we see Ben just destroying a car, it just doesn't affect us. But right now, everything is being brought up. Like oh yeah, he destroyed my dad's car, or he went crazy, or you know. So everything in this um everything that that Fantastic Four has been through is it's being brought up. So, um, a bunch of them, you know, it just doesn't look good for the Fantastic Four. They try to do good, but at the same time, uh, they kind of sacrifice bad things, uh, you know, so it just doesn't look good. Like, for example, um, Galactus, they had to bring the nullifier in to, you know, just uh, make Galactus focus on other places other than Earth. And, um, and the bad thing is that they don't know where the nullifier is. So... Uh, you know, that's a like a massive weapon that can destroy things, it can undo things, it looks like, undo its existence, it looks like. And, um, you know, Reed Richards doesn't have it, so who has it? So basically all the things, they do mistakes, and all of their mistakes are being brought up. So, you know, basically the Fantastic Four are just looking really bad, and um, Jennifer Walters is trying to win their case, but she can't, she's being, you know by this guy, I think his name is Talbin, or Talbin, and, um, he, she, they're, like, basically, you know, they just lost this trial, because everything is being brought up, and, you know, they can't really, they're being associated with things they ca didn't even cause, but that, now that you think about it, when they're brought up, you, you kind of think that it cost, you know, uh, like, there was a story about how Ben, you know, he was in a temper tantrum, and he destroyed somebody's taxi, and apparently the destruction of that taxi, uh, you know, the owner of that taxi got depression because he just paid the taxi, the, the the taxi in full, and, you know, it felt like he lost something big. So, you know, all those minor things, you know, you just don't think about it at the moment, but they do have a big effect. So, uh, I really like how James Robinson brought that. And um, I like how there's a lot of aftermath after this, you know, the kids, um, the FF, which is, you know, the the future foundation they're being um taken away and they're going to be with the the original human torch so a lot of things are changing and you know it makes it look it makes the fantastic four series very interesting so i think this issue was really good i gave it in a, a you know now that i think about it i'm going to give it um a 9 out of 10 it was good the art was good and i like how they brought everything back from the past so definitely i love this issue and i give it a 9 out of 10 and this is Fantastic Four, issue number five. So thanks for watching, guys. Hope you liked this video. And also, if you didn't subscribe to my channel, subscribe to my channel. Thanks, guys. Bye.